my dad. So sorry if I didn't vlog. I mean, I did, but I recorded on my phone. So today is Sunday, April 17, 2016. So, like I said, I went, like today it was church, and then after church, I went to go um, to the Museum of Tolerance, and it's located in West LA. And it was really fun. I actually enjoyed it. It was really sad. So when you go in, I didn't know. I could have brought you guys. I'm so sorry. But I did get some clips on my phone, so I'll import them right here. In September 1942, the Gestapo decided to organize a deportation of all the patients from the Welsh hospitals. In one of the hospitals, Ben Edelbaum's sister Esther. Why do you think you have to blame it on you? <laughs> She's a person. <laughs> 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 now, memories. Oh, you're taking a video. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, come in. <laughs> it was natural and normal for me to be here all the way from 1715 when I look at so many names like Espinosa, Corona uh, Gutierrez Santana, you know it makes me realize that I'm hooked up to all the families you know and uh, even ones that they're not in the paper mm -hmm. I'm a walking city I'm a walking world I am a walking universe. And I don't have any fear uh, towards uh, saying I am the best of all of this, you know, and my children will be the best of, of that, you know. Uh. So, so, this museum was second place during the Holocaust, and it was really sad. And then they'll give you like a little card of like a picture of, let's say, if it's like a kid or like a grown up. I got a, a boy, and his name was Peter Samogai. This is his. And it's basically like you put it into the computer, and it tells you about his story. So he was basically from Hungary, and he was. It's a long story, but I remember there were parts where it explained how he got harassed during school. And it felt like it was so sad. And then later on, it was like you have to return the cards back, and they'll tell you like if he survived or not. I think him. Yeah, he actually did survive, but he was, uh, he was part of this. Um, here I'll just read like a little bit of him. It said that, um. Now, let's see, where, where was the part where it said that he survived or not? Oh, so, okay, so, he actually did lost his mom and his sister, but him, his name was Peter, he said, Peter endured weekly experiments and saw corpses and murder daily. He also witnessed the Sonder Commando uprising in October 1944. In January 1945, with the approach of the Soviet Armed Forces, the remaining prisoners of Auschwitz II were forced to march to the main camp of Auschwitz, Auschwitz I. During the march, the German camp personnel abandoned the prisoners. The inmates were liberated in Auschwitz by the Soviets in the late 
So, okay, so at the end, like, he was able to survive during that time. Um, throughout the whole museum, it was a really, like, inspiring um, experience. I learned more about the Holocaust, and I also learned about, like, what else happened during that time and era. And what I learned is that, um, as of now, history is still repeating itself. And for us, we just got to remember that if there are times where someone gets bullied, we should be like those who are able to stand up for them and not just remain quiet. And that's what happened during that time too. A lot of people remain quiet and didn't know what to do. So I just want to inform you guys like, hey, like if something's going on, just be one of those people who are able to stand up. And yeah, and be brave. So with that being said, um, I'm going to end this vlog right now once it's about to start. I'm not going to do a live reaction because I already did that last time. But I do have an unboxing. I got a package. Um, but it's not really important. It's like a memory card and a flash drive that I need for next Saturday, which is a birthday party. Um, anyways, uh, I'm going to end this vlog. Sorry if it's short, but I'm going to combine from Thursday, Friday, and Saturday, and today. And I will, uh, what was it? Let me start up. <clears throat> Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it, and subscribe for more Vita videos, and I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye.